Hi guys, this is JNM again with a short video about Blender 2.79 and the new feature Denoising. This is the second release candidate of Blender 2.79 and this model made by Michael Pavlovich, link is added to the description, uses the new principled BSDF shader for PBR texturing. So let me show you the settings I used for cycles rendering. I set my cycles compute device to CUDA to enable rendering with my graphic card. That's important to fasten things up and then I switch to the render tab and set the device to GPU compute. I will render in full HD, but only six samples. Yes, because I want to see the difference when using denoising with a low sample rate. My tile size is by the way 256 and not 512 as I usually use, because I got some CUDA out of memory exceptions. So I stick to 256. So everything is set up. Hit F12 and render 6 samples. Ok, as expected, the result is really noisy. But that's fine, now let me select the Render Layers tab and enable Denoising. Just use the default settings and press F12 to render 6 samples with Denoising enabled. Here you can see it renders all the tiles and performs a denoising for each tile. And look at this result. These are really six samples. I guess when you see this render, you wouldn't say that this is done using six samples. So this feature is, in my opinion, a really amazing improvement. Okay, let's compare some renderings. Here is one with 8 samples and without denoising. And here with denoising enabled. Then I rendered with 32 samples and denoising disabled. And here's the denoised render with 32 samples. So this is really clean as far as noise is concerned. But as you can see, you are losing the details for the scratches. For example, it seems to be blurred out. So I played a little bit around with the parameters of the denoising feature. And here's a render with 32 samples, denoising enabled. And I set the radius to 2 and the feature strength to 0.30. And this seems to be a very good compromise. I get rid of the noise, but I don't lose most of the details. So guys, this was my short review for denoising with low sample rates. I hope you like it and it was useful. And if you like my channel, then don't forget to subscribe to not miss a future video. Thanks for watching and see you soon on JNM.